Our big story is one you and goodness knows police don't see every day. A man tased by officers walks to a police station to thank them. The man says Miami Township police saved his life and he spoke exclusively with Alexandra Lewis. She joins us now live with his story. Alex. Today, Douglas Booker, Booker was very emotional. He went as far as saying he owes Miami Township police his life. Put your hands up! April 18th, Miami Township police respond to a wrong way driver. Get out of the car now! A delirious Douglas Booker fought off police. <laughs> It eventually took 10 officers to restrain him in handcuffs and a taser to subdue him. We ended up breaking the window out of his car and physically turning his car off. That was Sergeant Kramer and Booker six months ago. <laughs> this is them today. I love these guys. At the time Douglas Booker lost control of his car, he was having an allergic reaction to antibiotics. It just shuts down you know, a part of your brain and then I go into this other part of my brain that comes out. We were actually physically brawling. We were fighting. Booker later found out that the shock of the taser saved his life. Him tasing me actually put my heart back in the rhythm. You know, I could have just died in his arms. Uh, it's just a lot of racial tension that has been going on in America. People need to see things in a different light. It's not always, it's not always about race. Booker says he's lucky to have walked away alive for various reasons. It could have turned out really bad. Yes. <laughs> you know, he could have fired his weapon and, and, and been rightfully so in doing it. He chose to know that there was something wrong with me. And it wasn't this, the cut off my skin. It's a thank you well received by humbled responding officers. Hey, we walk into situations all the time not knowing what, what's going on. We just deal with each situation as it occurs and uh, try to do the best we can to get people help. And, and, and this is what it should be. Seal carry license had a gun on him during the ordeal. Reporting live in Miami Township tonight, Alexandra Lewis, Fox 45 News.